Okay, collective, I got time for one more before I go pick up my phone from work. So let's see what messages are going to come out for you guys. And thank you. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? We're actually going to start with the Red Oracle deck. Y'all, these readings are for entertainment purposes only. Don't make anything fit. And please don't put anyone or any reader above your own intuition. Okay, spirit messages do you have for the collective? Oh. We have here and now. So somebody could be in a space of like going over the past, figuring out what it is that they need to do to get to their future goals. Could have required some type of change. 32 breaking down to a five. Okay. This could be surrounding matters of the heart. Put those cards right there. Something could be on TikTok, Instagram, something like that. You could be in the public. You've been picking up on it a lot lately. But I feel like that's what someone's doing in the here and now. What a spirit. Yeah, change. Change in the wind. There is someone oppressing. There's a house oppressing spiritual community. Possibly causing a lot of chaos and conflict. But there's something coming from a higher power. Wow. Because you see on, on these two cards with this change in the wind and this chaos and conflict. This zebra, that's always been my spiritual community. The, the psychics, the, the mediums, the sensitive, sensitives, the clairvoyants, the earth angels, the light workers, the star seeds, anybody on those type of, uh, on those paths, somebody could have painted you out to be something that you wasn't. See this giraffe here? They try to paint this giraffe out to be, I mean, this zebra out to be something else. So it could be someone with a master number 33, or some of y'all could be dealing with Mason. So someone's oppressing you. This it's like applying pressure to stop someone or to slow someone down. Okay. But with the higher power and regeneration, I feel like some of y'all could have been healed from something. Never ending story. I don't know what the hell this is. Here. But yeah, so somebody is looking, going over things that happened in the past. And like I said, maybe you're someone who's writing out goals, trying to figure out what it is you need to do to get to those goals. But in the meantime, there's someone oppressing you. Someone said family. I saw the Ten of Pentacles. Maybe someone's family doesn't want this or doesn't want you doing something. Could be that. Could have something to do with work. Okay. Page of Pentacles. There could be some type of breakthrough. I always tell y'all when this energy comes, like this oppression or oppression energy. You have to find a way to keep going some kind of way. Somebody could even be doing like depression spells or some shit. Could be a king of cups. Somebody from the past. So this person could have like a, a heavy axe, like island accent. <laughs> so my name could be Island. Alright, spirit, what we need to see. Six of Wands. Six of Wands and the King of Pentacles. Y'all dealing with somebody who is, uh, if it ain't about the money, don't be blowing me up and I ain't getting up. And so you could be someone who's on, like, the haves and have nots. You could be someone who doesn't have. And there could be wider family doing this. What else, spirit? <laughs> if I ain't got the money, don't be blowing me up, nigga. I ain't getting up. Spirit, what we need to see? What's the chaos and conflict? A king of swords.
This King of Swords about to lose his shit or her shit. Like, they keep fucking with you. They need to have more compassion about the situation. I just told you. Tower. Someone's getting overthrown or thrown out. This King of Swords did something. Okay, this King of Swords could be like an authority figure. Zipper reminds me of like a like a body bag. What the fuck is going on? See that zipper right there? Yeah. Ow. Knight of Swords. Three of Cups. What's back here? Judgment. The Emperor. And I, I feel like whatever this King of Swords is doing... Whatever's getting ready to happen is coming from this. And not not nobody else. I feel like it's coming from that. Because they did something. Alright, what else do you Somebody is blessed and highly favored, I feel. And that could be with the uh, suppression. Why they trying to suppress you? Some of y'all will be known for something. It'll be some type of star or celebrity. For some of you, your words could wake people up. Mm. Somebody trying to make you fail. Somebody could be speechless. Or somebody could want you to be quiet. Meditate for 15 minutes. Let it go. Somebody left someone in the wheel. Could be a lot. Somebody could have these life path numbers. What is spirit? What's this? If you could be experiencing disruptions of devices or some type of blackout. There could be something here with the American Red Cross. Someone could be in the military. So when I say military, stalker, evil eye. What's this? Author, someone may be the author. Somebody could be trying to control something. Some of you have a book inside of you, make time to write it. Or someone could want to write about you, about your life. Because, child, somebody's trying to paint somebody out to be something that they wasn't. Whatever that's going to mean. And it could have been, like the card said, your, your words wake people up. So if you were someone who has some type of popularity in the public, they could have wanted to try to like discredit you or disprove you or something. So, y'all got to take that how it's going to resonate now. Your DM is not who you think. Karmic man. I feel like that's who this is. They was doing too much. No issues were found. Somebody could watch you for protection. It says manifest that shit. Ooh, we they married to unalive and get insurance payouts. Child, I hope you ain't married. Cousin. So my cousin could be here. Put spell work on you, but we just saw that card where it says you broke the curse. Somebody dealing with a mason because of what you know. Some of you guys could receive, like, could get a dream job. I feel like you're dealing with somebody. It's powerful. That weather manipulation, I feel like this person, and superhuman strengths. You did somebody powerful. 
they is powerful. And they could be fucking with you with those powers, child. Or trying to suppress you. Maybe that's what the spell word was for, to suppress you. So, an ending of a major cycle. Make room for the new. Because with this regeneration, something new is coming through. Mm. Okay. Let's pull a life purpose. Leadership. Take charge of the situation. Because this King of Swords could have been coming at a Queen of Cups. I mean, that's like a... It's two different energies, like an impact and a nar. Yeah. All right, speaker. speaker. I already say your words wake people up. Your life purpose involves skills of oration. You're an earth angel who's born to protect. So th there's a king of swords or king of pentacles coming for her. Queen of Cups energy. Man or woman, okay? You can have healing energy. Energy healing. Your natural energy healing ability is an important part of your life purpose. And Listen to your intuitive feelings. Leadership. Take charge of the situation. And Earth Angel again. So, you just really came up again. It looked like a government. With that flag right there. This could be somebody in the government fucking with you. Maybe they feel like they they need to do this. I don't know. Yeah, beware. Somebody could be an, an entertainer. And then you have luck. Someone's luck could be changing for the better. You have writer again. We already got author right here. You have a book inside of you. Make time to write it. Or someone could want to write about your life. With this writer, stories matter. Your words have the power to influence others. Remember I said with that, your words wake people up. I said if you have some type of standing or something like that in the public, this person could try to discredit you. Somebody name could be destiny and loss. What's behind that? And motivator and entertainer. So we got speaker out here already. And this card says there's a skill you possess that needs to be shared with the world. Consider careers in coaching, speaking, lobbying, activism, or mentoring. Okay, some of you have natural gifts and abilities, but there's some type of loss. A job loss can make it difficult. I, I, cause I see this King of Swords doing something, but I do see something coming back on this King of Swords too. And the card says yes. I see it. Trust could have caused you to lose a job. something on a hold. Manifesting. You have all the tools you need to increase your income. Good fortune is coming to you soon and an opportunity may come for you to showcase your talent. Mm -hmm. Okay, y'all. That's what I got. I don't want to be late. Alright, let's close this out. Spirit. Control information flow. So your ass done had to work through spell work, work through oppression to try to control some information or something. Like, what the hell they thought you were going to say? <laughs> Are they doing that to all speakers? Probably not. All right, Spirit, let's see. You could be working with Ascendant Masters. They have innocence here because we just saw it says no issues were found. 
with this indigo. But your whole base chakra could be changed, right? We saw that regeneration. Could be some type of laws with home, career, and finances. And you got energy healing again. Your hands and your heart are activated to give healing energy to your loved ones and your clients. The person you're inquiring about is the indigo, meaning a highly sensitive, natural born leader. And it's powerful light work. It's like government coming up against these type of energies. And I don't know why. The world may never know. The world may never know, child. But Spirit say it's safe for you to be powerful. Your spiritual power brings great blessings and love and service to the divine. Alright, anything else? Be willing to forgive a new partner. We saw that they married and unalive, so be careful. Yeah. Okay, until next time.